Hey guys, today I wanted to teach you a quick trick that I learned when I first started music production in Ableton. Uh, this can apply to any door, and what it is, is how to produce music in key without knowing any music theory. So when I first started music production, I couldn't tell you what was in key and what wasn't, and this little trick really, really helped. So what I'll do now is teach you how to do a major scale, and then after that, a minor scale. To do a major scale, what we need to do is go down to our C, it can be any C, C4, C3, C2, but in this instance we'll do C3, and we'll place a note in there. And now we'll move up to C4, which is the next octave up, and place a note in there. Now all we need to do between C3 and C4 is fill in the white notes. Don't do the black, only the white. Now, every, every note that you can see there is in the scale of C major. So let's just move these across. And now if we play it, you'll hear that all notes are in key. Perfect. So currently these notes are sitting in your piano roll, so whenever you press play, these will also play. So an easy way to remove them is to just highlight them all click and drag the bottom note, or any note, and drag it to the left. Now as you can see it's outside the piano roll, so if I play, nothing's going to play, but we have our notes here for reference. Now another trick to hide all these black notes, or any notes that aren't in the scale that you're wanting to play at, come up here and hit the fold button. So now you'll only see the notes in this, in this instance in the scale of C major. So we can put notes anywhere and it, and it should sound fine. And that's great. That sounds like it's in key. Uh, it doesn't sound particularly good, but that is in key. Now if you want to do a different note, maybe not the C major, unclick fold, highlight all of them, grab your tonic, which is the first note of the chord, and drag up, down, wherever you want. So now we're in the scale of F3. So let's move this tonic note up, hit our fold again, and play. And there you have it. So that is the major scale. So for minor scale, the concept is exactly the same, but what we will do is start our scale from A. In this example, I'll find A3 to A4 and fill in all the white notes. So that is the scale of A minor. Highlight them all. Drag them to the left so they're out of the piano roll. Hit the fold button. And there you have A minor. Add notes anywhere in here. And it all sounds in key. So I hope that that's helped some of you out there that may be struggling with your music theory. It's always good to actually learn music theory, but this is a great way to get you up and running quite quick within Ableton Live or any door. Thanks very much and talk again soon.